something's playing with it. But I hadn't gone. There we go. Fish on. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the channel. Uh, if you're new here, I appreciate y'all tuning in. Uh, we're out today. We just uh, got a little slow start. It's another beautiful day, nonetheless. But we had some storms. And that's the last of the line of the storms that rolled through this morning and uh, actually came in last night and uh, prevented us from loading up. So I had to do it this morning. So that's why I'm getting out here a little late. And then I got to talking at the boat ramp with some nice gentlemen from uh, a couple counties over. And uh, we're going to get at it. Uh, stay tuned and we'll see what happens here in a little bit. All right, y'all. I tried getting some footage, but we've come out on the backside over here in the sound. Got a little bit of live bait. Didn't get many, but uh, through the casting a couple times, you can hear them hitting behind me. But uh, got about a dozen baits or so, along with our frozen bait. So we should uh, have a pretty good go out of here in a minute. I don't know if this pole up here was, it was dancing a little bit. like there's a weight on there oh it was dancing well that was not good it must have had a chafe on it we'll rig up and try again an arm's length the leader number seven circle hook one but i put about a they ain't having 200 pounds but i uh, this is going to be a 300 pound swivel uh, and we're going to Put a slider on the line above it we had a good hit a minute ago so hopefully uh that's going to be a good sign granted uh the frozen bait i put out hadn't had any uh, uh luck yet so we'll see what we got there it is it's not too big A little shark he knows he's on now Oop. yeah little shark oh. that was a quick release i don't know if you could see him but he's right there maybe uh a reason to move would get too many of them but uh check the line see where he chafed it get another hook on and get back on wind's kind of blowing me around where i want to cast is where this pole is so i need to come on the other side it might have been my rig oh no we're on Woo! all right we're on folks come on got a little head shake so that's good but it might be a shark it's not a ray in my other line I got another line there off the stern all right color looks like a sharky look at, that. Look at him come back here See if I can get this one leadered. There, there he is. <laughs> I felt his tail on it. Yeah, 
That was quick. Yeah, look at him. Look at him. Let's see my D hooker. That circle hook was in his jaw real good, but it's okay to rust out. Whew. That was fun right, and quick. We'll do a little different. I'm going to not put a weight on this one and leave it on top and see if we can get a little bit different action, but. There's our bait. All right, folks, well, we're back at the house. Hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, changing gears, I'm gonna try to be getting you some more beach fishing, uh, shoreline surf fishing videos here uh, the next couple weeks. Not to say we might throw the skiff overboard. I gotta do some work on my boat. I'm um, getting it uh, lined up for uh, our short uh, red snapper season. Um, so I was hoping I could get the wife and the kids out and uh, hopefully, the two days that we're going to have this year are going to coincide with some decent weather that it can be a family event. We can keep more than, uh, or basically everybody in the family can get their snapper, so to speak. So, um, but with that, got some more videos lined up. So keep uh, an eye out and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.